I didn't know that that I was going to be able to to really make it, to really get out there and make it, like overcome the challenges that be able to overcome all the challenges I was going to face trying to make a comeback, not just in wrestling, but in life. I got 15 years of, of bad choices and addiction and prison and homeless. I'm an ex-convict. I'm a, I'm a felon. You know, I'm a deadbeat father. And, uh, you know, looking back on it, um, I just wanted to be sober. I didn't know how to do it. I didn't really know that many people that had overcome that lifestyle and actually made a run at sobriety and success and, you know, like the outstanding all-star father and, and, and business owner and all these, I just, I didn't know. And so for me, early on, it was just about staying sober. And then it didn't take long for me to figure out my passion. Keep moving forward. When life comes at you and you get in a lie in the road or you get backed up against the wall, you're going to be able to dig into that toolbox I'm talking about. You're going to be able to bear down, get up and keep moving when things get hard. So if a guy like me can come out from homeless and years of addiction and prison and go on to become a national wrestling champion, an author, a, a man of integrity today. My story hasn't always been a success story. It hasn't always been <clears throat> standing at the top of the podium, you know, speaking to families and communities and kids about good positive lifestyle choices. I'm Rich Jensen from Be A Champion In Life. I own an organization that mission is to instill hope, and encourage leadership through power of story. Today we speak to upwards of 40, 50,000 kids a year around the nation about dangers of addiction, dangers of poor choices, and we talk about the importance of leadership and overcoming any of life's challenges that come your way. So we're going out on the road. We're taking a massive risk. We've decided that the world needs us out there more than ever before right now right now so we're gonna fire up our inspirational bus we're going from oregon to idaho to utah to colorado illinois new york pennsylvania down to florida back across the map and what we would encourage all you coaches and teachers and administration and parents that hear this that see value in what we do that want to be part of the solution help be a voice for us Help us, help get this message to your school. Let your administration know that this is a program we want in our school. Because I know that this could be the most important message you bring to your community. It's not just about drug addiction. You know, this isn't just about dangers of addiction and, and you know, it's, it's about life. Being resilient, the importance of staying focused, pushing through the struggles, you know, making a choice to stand out in the crowd maybe. Make a stand. Find value in who you really are and what you really want.